Okay, so I, I put all the pegs on, and you can see, I'll just go through them. This first one, it's got like a little one just on the side here, but it's got this main one. Oh, you can't see it because it's full knotted into the dread. You might just be able to see a slight bump. That was an original one. Take that peg off. Then look back here, I've got this one. It's got the little ball coming out the side. It's that one. There's another one. Alright. My other one. Um, is this the right one? Yep. It's the right one. So these are all just dread balls that have grown into dreads. Oh, they've congoed up with dreads. Got that one. And another one. This one. That's about it, I think. So what I was doing, I was just getting loose hair, dreadballing it down to the scalp, and then just leaving it, and then hoping it would not into a dread, which it most of the time did, so. That's a pretty cool method. You want to try that one. Yeah, I'm not too fussed about having really neat dreads, and you want to get rid of a bit of loose hair, but that's about it. This one's sticking out a bit, actually. So I'll give you a look. Oh, I did one of these hair wraps. I've seen a, people, a few people do it now. And I just thought, you know, I mean, it might look alright on one of my dreads, so I tried it. Go around, give it a spin.